Hi, I'm Jeff, your ProtoPy expert, and I'm super excited to introduce you to my second masterclass all about voice interaction. Voice interaction is something that ProtoPy does exceptionally well. And in this course, we'll be building out an always listening voice assistant named Avery. We'll wake up Avery with the phrase, hello, Avery. How can I help? We'll ask Avery about the weather. It's currently five degrees and overcast. Avery will ask us to be more specific. I can be more specific. What time are you going out? Around five. At five o'clock, there's a 30% chance of rain. You might want to carry an umbrella. We'll set up a universal dismissal command. Hello, Avery. How can I help? Never mind. We'll ask Avery to play a song, and Avery will take one of two actions depending on the course of the conversation. Hello, Avery. How can I help? Play a song. Would you like me to pick a song for you? Yes. Okay, here's my favorite song. And we'll be able to ask Avery to stop the music. Hello, Avery. How can I help? Stop the music. Okay. Like the first masterclass, I'll be teaching you some of my very own techniques that you can use in your day-to-day -day protopie work. I'll show you how to make a timer that can be canceled. I'll show you how to make a recursive loop. Yep, that's right. It is possible to make a looping construct in protopie. And I'll teach you how to use send and receive to make organized and reusable interaction logic. This course is not going to be as intense as the first masterclass, as you'll be able to complete it in about three hours. But in that time, you'll have learned everything you need to know to start making your own voice interactions in Protopy. To those of you who completed my first masterclass, welcome back. And if you're new to Protopy School, welcome, and I hope you find this course as well as the many other tutorials you'll find here useful. Enroll now, it's free.